Hello friends, this is Brother Carlos here and uh, I'd like to invite you to, par to participate of my online courses, okay? Now, the, the requirements are you must be teachable and you must be duplicable, okay? What do I mean by that? Well, Jesus said in Matthew chapter 28 verse 18, Go into all the world and make disciples of all nations. What did he mean by that? To make disciples of all nations is to train people to duplicate what you are doing. By training people, making disciples, you are training them to also duplicate themselves. That's the idea. That's the goal, right? Most people, they struggle financially. Let me say this to you. They struggle financially especially financially, because they don't know what they're doing. They don't know they have been breaking God's principles, okay? And that's exactly what causes people to hurt themselves financially, and that end up hurting themselves in other areas as well, including marriage, including family, you know, that kind of stuff. So what we are doing, we are equipping people like yourself, okay, to you know, to duplicate yourselves in, in order for you to also generate income, a steady income, okay? That can start as just some extra money, part-time income, and then full-time income, and then eventually you can even become a millionaire, right? Those things are there, you know, those opportunities are out there. Now, let me say this to you. God wants his people free, set free. Jesus told his disciples, if you are indeed my disciples, you will know the truth and the truth will set you free. So we already know that driving out demons will not set people free because demons can come back. Okay, but teaching people about the truth of God's word, that will set people free. That's exactly what Jesus said. If you are indeed my disciples, then you will know the truth and the truth will set you free. Now. My online courses are designed to help people like yourself to become successful in everything you do. Okay, Psalm 1, everything he does shall prosper. It comes from the word of God, friends. Okay, God wants you free in order for you to prosper, in order for you to also start helping other people, especially the poor. He wants us to give money to the poor, right? The Bible says, whoever gives to the poor lends to God. Okay, so basically, by being teachable and also duplicable, you are going to start duplicating yourselves and you're going to start making disciples. And then all of a sudden, God's people are set free and now they can invest in God's kingdom. Now they can help the poor. If you don't have money to give to the poor, how can you obey that principle from the word of God? In order to give to the poor, you must have more than enough. Otherwise, you cannot give it to the poor. Friends, okay, I'm talking about money, but please do not love money. Money is designed to serve us, okay? We don't serve money. I don't follow money. Money follows me, okay? Jesus needed money, okay, to pay his tax. Apparently, he did not have money on him, okay? He told Peter, Peter, go to the lake, throw a line, catch a fish, open its mouth, there's a coin there, go pay your tax and pay my tax. Jesus called money into existence because he had a need, okay? He didn't sit around and wait for that money to come, you know, to fall off a tree or something. He did, no, he told Peter, Peter, I already called money into existence, now you go and work for it. Friends, God wants you to have money to bless the poor, okay, to bless other people, okay, to expand his kingdom on earth. It takes money to do those things, friends, okay? Now, who are the people that qualify to, you know, to study, you know, my courses and to start duplicating themselves? Well, I'll tell you right now, those who do not qualify. If you are a lazy couch potato and you love movies and you love eating popcorn and drinking coca-cola sitting in front of a tv flipping channels this is not for you okay if you depend on the government okay for assistance this is not for you friends i'm sorry it's not 
okay? If you are too old and you don't even know how to turn a computer on and off, this is not for you, folks. If you fear men, okay? If you fear people, this is not for you, folks, okay? If you put your confidence in men, rather than in God, then this is not for you, folks. You must have a desire to help people. If you don't have desire, a desire to help people, this is not for you, okay? I want to train you. I want to teach you how to put principles in place that will set you free and then will set your family free and then will set other people free through you, okay? By you being duplicable by you duplicating yourself you can set people free god wants his people set free god wants his people set free he does not want his people in egypt okay depending on the government in egypt god wants his people free and he wants his people producing okay creating okay multiplying okay and benefiting from what god has to offer to us that's what god wants us to do friends okay you must have a entrepreneur spirit because this is for people who like to succeed in life in order to help other people okay so the money lovers they only love money everything they think is about investment in god's mind Okay, the first investment he wants you to make is in his kingdom to help his kingdom expand on this planet. Second, to help the poor. Okay, these are the investments that you should have in your mind the whole time if you want to prosper under God's principles. Now, most people, they don't prosper in everything they do because they are constantly breaking God's principles, not even knowing. Okay, because they don't know God's principles. They don't study the word of God. They don't hear their pastors preaching about. All their pastors preach about is about tithing. Okay, tithing is not enough, folks. Tithing is not enough. Believe me. Okay, there are some other principles that if you do not put them into practice, basic God's principles, you will not prosper. Even by being a tither. You will not prosper. Listen to me. I am willing to teach you in order for you to teach others. Okay? I'm not a selfish person. My knowledge, I wanted to pass on because my knowledge came from God. My anointing came from God and I want to pass that on to you. I want you to prosper. I want you to become a millionaire to honor God and help expand God's kingdom on earth and help the poor. Okay? That's what this course is all about. I'm going to invite you to, you know, sign up for my online course, okay? Because I'm going to train you, okay, to become a dynamite to hell. And Satan is going to hate you so much because you're going to prosper now. From now on, you're going to prosper. From now on, your understanding will be expanded, okay? So let me say one, one, one more thing here. The word of the Lord says, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instruction. What is instruction? Instruction is education. If you despise education and you don't want to learn from anybody, then you are a fool. You are making a fool of yourself and you're going to be dead broke. You're going to be always under curses because you don't know god's principles okay instruction is very important you must educate yourself you must gain knowledge you must gain wisdom and understanding in order for you to be able to help others and help your own family and help others succeed i'm gonna train you and and, and i'm gonna help you okay to duplicate yourself because that's what i do i'm constantly duplicating myself and that should be your motivation to in this online course that i have that i am offering okay i'm gonna train you okay to become duplicable okay so you can duplicate yourself and help other people i'm gonna teach you god's principles that will work for you okay even while you're sleeping they're working for you i'm gonna teach you god's principles that will bring money your way that will bring blessings your way and will make you even healthier than you are now, okay? It only takes God's principles. You need to master 
about God's principles because everything is about God's principles, okay? Without knowing God's principles and without applying them, you can never succeed in any area of your life. What is the point of becoming a millionaire and then you are sick, you are diseased, you are dying of cancer, okay? Well, the Word of God also has principles in that regard, okay? The Bible says that God bless us with prosperity and He adds no trouble to it. Okay, so, you know, that's what I'm saying. If God is going to bless you with prosperity, he also will bless you with good health. So you'll be able to enjoy that. That's what I'm talking about, friends. The world does not know this. Okay, this is a gold mine. Okay, God wants his people educated. God wants his people set free. And God is calling you to get trained Okay, in order for you to duplicate yourself and make disciples of all nations and train people to be successful, to, cons to love God above everything else, okay, and to obey his principles, okay, in order for them to prosper and succeed in everything they do, okay, amen? So sign up for my course, okay, I'll see you soon, all right? God bless you now and have a good day, bye.